Hey everybody, welcome back to my summer car how-tos on the Game of Day Gamer channel. I'm Josh the Game of Day Gamer, and today we're going to work on the exterior of our car. First up, we're going to grab a spanner 10 to put the steering wheel on. Then we're going to put the gear stick in. The gear stick uses 6mm spanner, 3 bolts. Then it's time for the gear linkage. The gear linkage uses a 5mm spanner. Now we're going to build the dashboard. Pop on a light here. Now the dashboard meters is very interesting because you actually have an options. You can put in the RPM gauge or you can put in the clock. To hell with that. We can always use the clock when it's in here. It seems to be working as far as I can tell. So we're going to rotate this guy up. And we're going to pop in the RPM gauge. And then we're going to make sure we pop in the radio. Nice. Then we're going to actually install the main dashboard. That's going to be two 10 millimeter nuts. Now we can install the meters. And that's going to take six millimeter spanner. Now it's time for the handbrake. First, we're going to grab our eight millimeter. You'll need a spanner number seven to finish the e-brake line. There we go. Now it's time. Now it's time to install the seats. Now it's time to install the seats. First, we're going to do the back seat. We're going to need a nine millimeter spanner. Then we're going to dra grab the driver's seat first. That's going to be a total of four bolts. And I seem to have knocked my e-brake out of place, so we'll put that back. All looks well there. Looks like that other piece held. So now it's time for the passenger seat to complete the interior. Alright, and that's our interior. 